city we do like demonstration like demonstration in in, in Ramallah demonstration in Kalkiria demonstration in Bethlehem demonstration in Turkarim Nablus it's around the West Bank which is like so much people so much people and today it was thousands of people who demonstrate in the center of Ramallah where I live it's my in my city and we also do like a big demonstration which was so much people who's international and uh, Palestinian international and Israeli and also activists in this in this demonstration who support Gaza and we like we call for stop the war in in Gaza city now okay uh, do you have any news from uh, Gaza at the moment uh, do you know anyone there that uh, can report on this situation right now obviously we heard reports that uh, maybe the Israeli army is going to uh, invade Gaza uh, are things quieter now in Gaza no, I don't think so. It's quiet. I have I have much friends who live in Gaza. And I have like friends who's reporting also there. But I think the situation in Gaza is still like in the last few hours there was too much bombs and they bombing Gaza uh, right now. And the situation is really like a little bit not that good, you know. And there's still like a war and the Israeli strike Gaza and bombing there. And killing much people who's like people who died and the last report i saw like was 25 people who killed but like uh, since the beginning of the strike of the gaza 25 people and 200 say 65 people who get injured there and the majority is like uh, civilians or or children or mothers or fathers who died there of course, Gaza is a, has a huge population of children. I think uh, more 50% 50, 50 of the population in Gaza is actually children, right? And more than the, the more than the 50% of the, of the people who live there is the children. It's like more than because people have much children there, and that's why it's like the most like and also the most place in the world who live like has inhibitant inside it you know like mm -hmm. one almost one and more than one and a half million who live in a small area there in one city and and surround it with the with the borders and checkpoints and you cannot go out or enter the of course I'm, I'm i'm sure the humanitarian like we all know that the humanitarian situation the ongoing humanitarian situation in gaza is always uh, bad, but uh, surely right now the situation must be much, much, much worse. Uh, do, do you get an idea what, how uh, is the daily life now of people in Gaza? Uh, any reports of the communication or water, uh, electricity being cut? Yeah, what well, what I see like what like what we get the news because I live you know I live in West Bank in Ramallah and like what I get the news like there is like. Or people who report from there, they, they cut the electricity and the situation is really bad because you know, like there is much people who injured and much people who in hospital or sick or the people who's who are already in hospital before the war, you know. Mm -hmm. And when they cut the electricity there, this is like can be much people who died because of this. And also, there's like uh, also I don't think so the life it will be good now for the people because. When they're striking, it's much of the scary life and the pump life, like like they pumping their life and pumping and they kill people there. And I don't think so. The situation will be okay with the sound mm -hmm. of the pumps and the strike and the rockets there, you know. And the planes, like Israeli F-16, who's always go around the sky of Gaza, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. What uh, Aham, they, obviously this happened last few days, but. Uh, we spoke about before about uh, the Israeli government uh, choosing this point uh, because of the elections coming up. Uh, do you think that that's the reason behind all these attacks right now? I don't. I don't get it. What you ask me? Uh, basically, I'm talking about uh, the timing of the attacks. Uh, w w yeah. w what was the reason behind this timing? Uh, anything to do with the elections? Uh, yeah, I think everybody know like that, like the timing of this because the elections like in Israel is coming soon, and now Netanyahu he want to get more views. That's what he like. That's why he making the the airstrike and the, the war in Gaza.